the uh, the tent set up. I have my wine, and I'll take you for a little tour around the uh, the tent here. So over here we have the prints where people can easily flip through and see the different prints. I have these set up in the plastic packaging to protect it, as well as on white foam core. And then we have the certificate of authenticity giving all the detailed information about the piece and a little bit of information about me so they can connect with me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. That's going to add like an extra level of authenticity to your print. And then I have that all priced down here for people to grab quickly and go. We have the frame pieces up here for people with the prices next to it. I also want to make sure it's nice and clear that we accept cash and card. A lot of times people are at these events, they don't know you can take card. Um, and then I'm available for commissions, I teach art classes, um, and to sign up for the event information. So we have all the pieces hung up. We have them on these little hooks. They are just little S hooks. And that is how each piece is hung on this net mesh here. There's different kinds of tents, different ways to hang art, but that is, is the way that I'm doing it. Um, and then all these are just little like chalkboard signs I got at Michaels that you can put the price tags on. We have another um, art holder here so that maybe you have people already at that art holder so you wanna have another one so other people can be at this one. And then we have a table with my portfolio in it so that people can see a little bit about me, my information, where I've shown, like that, that's you can see some of the art that maybe I don't have here tonight, and they can just flip through it. I also have my iPad set up and ready to go, so that it can capture their information. So they'll go right to my website, they can see some more of my art, and then they can subscribe right here. We also have, just in case technology fails us, we have the paper version. So the top two I already filled out, so they're preset. It shows people kind of example, makes them more inclined to fill out their information. Also because it's windy, I have it on the clipboard, and we have some postcards ready to go to give people. Make sure you bring pens. Let's see, so for lighting, we have some Christmas lights just to catch people's attention, add just a little extra touch. And then we have up above in the rafters here, um, we have the can lights. You might want to come from this direction and look back up this way. All right, so we have the, the simple can lights you can buy them at like Home Depot or Lowe's. Um, and then they are hooked into just a center cord here and it is wrapping around all the way down to our power source. So lighting is crucial at outdoor evening events. If you don't have light, you just, you might as well just not even come. So um, this is, we got a moth in here already. Um, <laughs> this is it, this is the art show and it's all set up and uh, now we just need for the people to come up and buy all the art. So my name is Ben Perry and uh, I am the boyfriend helping the fine artist Lauren Jane set up her tent. This is the first time that I've ever um, done anything like this. Helping her set the tent up, I've noticed that it's, uh, it's, it takes some work. It's not just setting up the tent, it's not just putting the top on, it's making sure that there's power around it, making sure that the lights go up, making sure that the lights are on the art once the art is up, putting up the walls, putting up the different pieces of art once the walls are up. Oh, it's not just the walls. There's little uh, heavy weights at the bottom in order to uh, basically ground these walls so they don't flow. <laughs> <laughs> and so, um, yeah, so it's a lot of work and some people pass by and some people like it. I noticed that I was, uh, I got everything that I needed to get and I'm sitting off to the side, letting my beautiful girlfriend do what she needs to do. So I decided that I'm just gonna play some music in my car. Turn up the volume a little bit. And it got some people to come over and they said literally we came over here because we, we, we liked what music you were playing. So that's something else you probably take as a, a tip, that if you're going to have your art set up and you have a car next to you, play some music. Play some music that'll get some people coming over because it's that vibe, it's that emotion that people like when they're just passing by and you got some good beats going on. 
and I'll be sure to get some people to come over. So on the way here, uh, life happened as it does, and uh, on the day of an event, a lot of things will happen that you just can't foresee. Um, a difference between an amateur and a professional is that you just you have to rally, you have to come through whatever hardship it is, and come out on the other end and have your beautiful art set up and still smile. Um, so what happened was there ended up being road closures because they're doing a giant corporate uh, like 5K around all of downtown Orlando. So we had to figure out which way we get into this exact location, which was in the, the square of the entire run. Um, so we were able to finally figure out a way in. Um, and oh, on top of all of that, I go out, I have all my art, you know, I'm getting ready to get into the car. And then I find out that my car accidentally got towed. I forgot to put a sticker on it, et cetera, et cetera. I thought my car had been stolen at first. Find that it was, it was towed. Um, and then I'm like, how am I gonna fit the tent in? Um, it doesn't fit in the Lexus. So how am I gonna, how am I gonna get the tent there? I realized Uber has the larger vehicles that you can, uh, you can get Ubered in. Had to call the lady, make sure that she could fit a six foot tent in her vehicle. And it ended up being an awesome ride. I met an awesome lady and we talked about how she was from New York. She was very sweet. She was very encouraging and said, you know, this is all meant to be. And I rallied. So I was a professional. I got my art up. I got it here through the race, through the towing. And uh, I'm going to Uber home with my art tent and all my art and just be a professional and smile about it. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> <laughs> That's all. <laughs>